Hello again, it's Lynette from PreppingOnTheBudget.com. Today I thought I would show you um, the easiest way I've found to store cabbage. As you can see, I've been working on some of the cabbage out of our garden. Pretty decent sized cabbage heads here. Uh, grocery store price, probably two to three dollars each. And um, we planted, I don't know, maybe 20, probably about 20 heads of uh, cabbage, rather. And um, it took about six or eight weeks to grow. Absolutely no trouble at all. And I'm just now starting to harvest what we planted a few weeks ago. Now, all I'm doing is simply, I uh, have already washed these. I've removed some of the extra leaves. This will just simply go to the chickens or the pigs one. No waste around here. I took the cabbage, cut off the end of the stalk, split it into quarter size wedges, and then I just simply put it in a gallon size freezer Ziploc bag. Dated it, and so that way I'll know what it is, labeled it and dated it. And then I'm only putting three wedges per bag because for my family, that'll be plenty for one meal. If I put four in there, then one of them's going to go to waste, and I don't want to waste the harvest. So this is the absolute easiest way I've ever found. Cabbage tends to be um, extremely moist. As you cut these open, you can see how they've been holding the water. So after you put them in the freezer, take them out you know, whenever you want some fresh cabbage, it'll still be moist and um, because you know, the water, of course, will freeze. And you can fry it. Uh, you could steam it, put it in soup, do whatever you want to with it. So I just wanted to show all the novices out there like myself. It's not, it's not hard, it's very easy, and it's extremely cost effective. Thanks. Check us out on the website, preppingonabudget.com.